Hi everybody, welcome to Cryptolina channel. Today we are going to look at the 5 minutes uh, trading strategy that has an amazing win rate. I call it Eliger RSI strategy. We are going to go through the rule of this strategy in details and also the indicators we are going to be using with their settings. After that we go through multiple examples and uh, we will go through some false signals as well. One important disclaimer. This video contains no financial advice and it's only for informational purposes. But before we start, uh, don't forget to subscribe to my telegram group where I share all my crypto trades for free and also don't forget to claim your personal $4,500 bonus on Bybit. All you need to do is make registration and make your first deposit on platform and after that you can receive your personal bonus and also if Bybit don't work in your country, you can use BitChat and get your $5,000 bonuses. All the necessary links will be in the description and in the first pinned comment. Let's get started. So first we will take a look at the indicators that we are going to be using in this strategy. We are going to be using two indicators for this strategy. The first one is, as you guys would have guessed by now, the main indicator for this strategy is Ligere RSI. This is an indicator that responds quickly to price changes while minimizing the number of false signals. Ligia RSI is a perfect choice. I will show you exactly how to use this amazing indicator in the right way. And to give you one of the best trading strategies with this tool that you can follow right away and make really good profits. So Ligia RSI is a similar to a 4 period regular RSI, except that a Ligia transform has been applied for a price smoothing. In short, Ligia transform is a mathematical technique that allows smooth indicator to be built using small amounts of data. This smoothing minimizing the choppiness that a regular full period RSI would otherwise have. So in trading view, we will click on the indicators tab and search Ligere RSI. We will add this one right here. We can see this indicator consists of a blue Ligere RSI line and two horizontal levels uh, which are set at 20 and 80. The second indicator we are going to be adding is the Super Trend Plus. It basically aggregates many buy-sell signals and confirmation and by combining them provides a strong buy-sell signal or trend confirmation. So this one mainly helps in trend confirmation and increases profit rate as a result. The third indicator we are going to add is VEDA ATOM explosion. This one is by Shane Key M. Now we need to change the settings on these indicators. Here we will go in settings for Super Trend Plus and change the Super Trend multiplier from 3 to 4. And now in settings for Weight Data, Explosion in Style section, let's get rid of the dead zone and make the explosion line a bit more visible. Now our charts are set and we can get into the strategy. So let's talk about the rules for entering a long trade. Number one. The price action should be above the super trend and the super trend line should be colored in green like it's here. Number 2. The Ligier RSI blue line has to cross the lower band from the bottom to top like it's doing right here. Then on the Vedeta explosion the bar needs to be colored in dark green and it needs to break above the explosion line exactly like this. Once all these conditions are met, you can go in for a, a buy trade right at the close of that candle. Don't panic if you don't get it, I will show you multiple examples soon. So let's talk about the rules for entering a short trade, which are the exact opposite to the rules of the long trade. Number 1. The price action should be below the super trend and the super trend line should be colored in red, like it's here. Number 2. The Ligier RSI blue line has to cross the lower band from top to bottom like it's doing right here. Number 3. On the Vedeta explosion the bar needs to be colored in dark red and it needs to break above the explosion line, exactly like this. Once all these conditions are met, you can go in for a sell trade right at the close of that candle. So these are the rules for both short and long trade for this strategy. Quite simple, right? Now I'll talk about some examples for short and long trade. Before we do, I will answer a question that's often asked. Indeed, many of you ask on what crypto exchange I trade. 
I do this on the Exchange Buy Bit. It's an easy to use platform on which you can open, buy and sell positions. In addition, you can use it for price layout on which you can keep an eye on multiple prices at the same time. I put a link in the description so you can visit Bybit. They additionally have a bonus of over $4,153 that you can use to trade. Here is a good example for a buy trade. The price action is above the super trend indicator and it's green. Here we see have dark green candle and the Ligier resize growth in the lower band from bottom to top. So we will get in the trade at the close of this candle. And we will keep out stop loss below the recent swing low and we'll keep the risk to reward ratio from 1 to 1.5. And this would have ended in a profitable trade, as you can see here. Here is a good example for a short trade. The price action is below the super trend indicator and it's red. Here we have dark red candle and the Ligier RSI is breaking below the upper band from top to bottom. So uh, we will get in the trade at the close of this candle and we will keep our stop loss above the recent spin high. And we will keep the risk to reward ratio from 1 to 1 and a half and this would have ended up in a profitable trade, as you can see here. This strategy is very good and effective if used properly. You have to make sure that you follow the rules strictly and get in trade when all the criteria are checked. For example, you can see here for a buy trade the blue line is crossing the lower band from top to bottom. We have a dark green candle breaking the explosion line, but the price action is below the super trend, so we will not get into this busy position and it's false one. So beware of this and just follow the explained rules for profitable results. By the way, traders, this is not a regular super trend. As we can see, sometimes the line can be low yellow and this indicates a range in market. So make sure you don't take any trades during this time. Let's take a look at one more example for both short and long trade. Here is a good example for a buy trade. The price action is above the super trend indicator and it's green. Here we have dark green candle and the Ligier RSI is crossing the lower band from bottom to top. So we will get in the trade at the close of this candle and we will keep our stop loss below the recent win low and we will keep the risk to reward ratio from 1 to 1.5. And this would have ended in a profitable trade, as you can see here. Here is a good example for a short trade. The price action is below the super trend indicator and it's red. Here we have dark red candle and the Ligier RSI is breaking below the upper band from top to bottom. So we'll get into trade at the close of this candle and we will keep our stop loss above the recent swing high. And we will keep the risk to reward ratio from 1 to 1.5. And this would have ended in a profitable trade, as you can see here. Please backtest this strategy yourself so that you can understand the potential of this strategy. So overall, I would say that this strategy is really profitable and I think this strategy would perform even better on higher time frames because on higher time frames you don't usually have a lot of noise in the market and because of less manipulations on higher time frames your risk of getting stopped out is really low you can also try the strategy on different markets too so that's all for now don't forget to put your likes and comments uh, if you found this video useful subscribe to my channel and i will be back with another good strategies bye